Hello and welcome to a bite-sized Unity tutorial. Today we are going to take a look at some settings which can frustrate some developers when testing out their game in Engine. Remember to subscribe and click the notification bell to stay up to date with every tutorial I upload. Feel free to leave a comment or drop a like. I also have a Patreon page where you can help be a part of this channel and you'll find assets and plenty of other things there too. You can also now join as a free member. So have you ever built a great looking game in the scene view, played it, but it looks all distorted and pixelated in your game view. It doesn't look too bad in here because it's mainly low poly, but I know I have in other things. And what makes it weirder is that when you build the game, it just looks fine. It doesn't look distorted or pixelated at all. Well, it's a simple fix that isn't necessarily obvious in some versions of Unity. In older versions, you simply have to make sure that this scale slider is 1x rather than currently 1.3x. So increasing it makes it look a bit more distorted and pixely. Reducing it makes it look more normal. But what if your version is like mine and won't go as low as 1x? Mine only goes as low as 1.3x and still looks not so good. Well, did you know that there's another setting which is not so obvious that you need to change? If we go here where it says free aspect, you just need to untick low resolution aspect ratios. And all that will do is make it look a little bit smoother. Make it look normal, as it were, less distorted and less pixelated. So this does become more apparent when it comes to UI elements. So if I go into a different scene, and if I re-enable that low resolution, you can see just how distorted this character looks on screen. So this is a UI image and it just doesn't look smooth. You can see the grunty little pixely bits at the side of her. So just remember, turning off that low resolution aspect ratio will make everything look normal again. It's one of those settings which is so obvious when you find it, but finding it can be such a pain. So I hope that's expanded your knowledge a little in Unity and remember to subscribe and click notification bell and you can stay up to date with every tutorial I upload. See you next time.